but I do know that all the stress and the work that teachers put in day in and day out, um, we do not feel like is being adequately compensated. And I do feel like the part of the bill that addresses that will help a lot of families, including mine. Um, I also wanted to address the maternity leave. Um, as a recent mom, um, I can attest to the fact that having districts have the opportunity to opt into a maternity leave policy would greatly affect moms. Um, I was one of the moms that had to figure out how many days I had saved up, not take, day, t take leave while I was pregnant if I was sick, um, simply because if I took a day, I would not have that day paid whenever I did have the baby. Um, we ended up having to have a C-section early. Um, and so we had, I had days that I did not have um, pay. And of course there is short-term disability, um, but it does not fully compensate moms and it adds additional stress um, to families and particularly to moms who need and want to be there for their newborn baby. Um, I know there's a lot of parts of this bill that have been discussed today and I have enjoyed listening to everything and I know that there are concerns um, of people, but I wanted to make sure that that the positives of this bill have been addressed and um, have been made known that there are people um, that want this to pass um, and continue the conversation and the discussions of the concerns that have been presented. Um, it, it would greatly affect my family um, and would reduce some stress that we have currently had. So I thank y'all and I appreciate um, y'all listening. to us today. Thank you very much. Okay, let me